in a big insurance premium. Let's go on the rides, Uncle Woody. Gee, uh, don't you want to win one of these fabulous prizes first? Cock-a-doodle-doo to you. Actually, no. Okay, I'm ready to make sure you don't win. <laughs> Uncle Woody. Yeah, thanks, Uncle Woody. See ya. Hey, they hit that target. The dummy didn't dunk, dummy. Well, I think there's some cheating going on here, bub. I want to try for myself. <laughs> Whoa, palsy wowsy, chum o' mine. Put your money away. Don't get a bent beak over losing some dumb calico cockadoodle rooster. <laughs> if you play a kitty game, you only win a kitty prize. But if you play the big games, you win <laughs> the big prizes. Let the games begin. Watch how easy it is, chum. <laughs> Sports car, mister. Hey! Gee, that's too bad, Ace. You lose again. <laughs> I need a bigger mallet. I'm hitting this one out of the park. <laughs> Hold on, sucker! <laughs> Whoa! Hey, Uncle Woody! Look at us! <laughs> Thanks, Uncle Woody! This is great! Yeah! There's something funny going on with these games. Buddy, pal, chum, don't get mad. Get even! Why, a woodpecker of your obfuscated talents should try a game of skill! <laughs> Any pointers? Not a chance. The federal type regulations require I uh, check the air pressure of that ball before every toss. Perfect. It's just right for sticking it to you. Uh, I mean, uh, sticking it to me. Because uh, I think you're going to win this time for sure, champ. I got some serious questions about your games, mister. And I got just one question for you. Ever play darts? Of course, you need some eye-hands coordination to win this game, sport. They don't call me Eagle Eye Woody for nothing. Uh, I wouldn't want to distract you, so I'll just stand behind you. Try again. 
Yeah, but this time I'm going for broke. <laughs> That's what I like to see. A real chump. I mean the champ. Just line up my ten darts right here in front of me, bub. We aims to please. I'll just stand out of the... Hey! Oh, 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 oh. How about that? I just won every prize you have, carny man. You cheated, woodpecker. Whoa, what about you, Mr. Spring and Glue and fans and step right up and let me rob you blind? Oh! <laughs> step right up, folks. Try your luck. <laughs> Everyone's a winner! <laughs> it's so easy to win, folks. You practically float away with all our prizes. <laughs> Some rock candy, please. <laughs> this blows chunks, mostly the big kind. Yeah! Rigging the games again, eh, Buzz? Psst. Well, we have ways of dealing with cheats like you. Okay, fire away, kid. Oh, good! <laughs> I give! I give! Stop already! I'm a drowner! I'll never cheat again! I swear! No! Tuned for the Mr. Alias Action Hour. Today's adventure, the attack of... No! Not the antenna again! Uh, where am I gonna get a new antenna before my show starts? <laughs> I love the sound of a sucker in the morning. A buzz buzzard super duper deluxe satellite dish. And now for the Coupe de Grass. Oh, when you're good, you're me. Good day, sir. I am Buzz Buzzard of Buzz's Satellite TV Service. Wow! That's right, sucker. Or I uh, mean, sir. Our rooftop dish here is powered by uh, 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 a solar plutonium reactor. <laughs> oh, he is good. So it gets 1138 channels, downloads video games, does your dishes, files your taxes, uh, takes out the trash and raises your children. All for the low, low price of just 50 bucks. Will it get me the Mr. Alias Action Hour right now? Oh, indubitably. Then you gotta deal. Hey, 
Looks like that lightning jolt gave us both superpowers. And mine are gonna make me rich, rich, rich. Stop, thief! <laughs> Time to make like a banana and split. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> this is not my day. <laughs> so, you want to play rough, huh? Also, the matter of I ain't giving it to you. Freaky feet, do your stuff. Huh? So long, bouncing boy. Get back here! Beating bullet train full of dough. <laughs> it's Super Buzzard! Coming to rob a town near you. <laughs> Super Woody gets his tough in gear! Ew! You owe me 50 bucks! Yeah? Take this for an IOU, Woodpecker! I'll take whatever you got, Bob! for going off the air due to a strange electrical interference. However, we'll now pick up the Mr. Alias Adventure Hour from the very beginning with no further interruption. <laughs> All summer long, the little ants work and work, storing food for winter, while the grasshopper fiddled his mind away. When winter came, the ants had plenty of food. The grasshopper was cold and hungry. Ah, uh, that's a lot of baloney. Just look at them. Work, work, work. They never have any fun. Hey, you're not an ant. You're a grasshopper. Yep, that's right. But the ants taught me a lesson. Great. Work! <laughs> Just the thought of work tires me out.
Could one of you step in the lobby and get me a candy bar? <laughs> right back at you. Oh. What was that? Huh? What was it? That was the wolf at your door. A wolf? Yeah, wolfie. Yeah, wolfie. Yeah, wolfie. Yeah, wolfie. Well, what do you know? If it ain't my old friend Red Riding Hood in person. And what, might I ask, have you got in the basket? I've got a basket of food for my grandma. I bet you, I bet you have, I bet you. You don't say. Mind if I have a look? Hmm? Clear. 
Vision. Vision. <laughs> I love this show. <laughs> and now it's time for our bonehead home round. What color is the Red Sea? Hello. The water in the Red Sea is blue. That's right. You've just won a fabulous bonehead swimming pool. It'll be delivered in less than one hour. Yippee! <laughs> Woohoo! Uh, oh, no. Miss Meanie will never let me have a pool. But if I can get them to put it in when she's not here, she can't make me take it out. Say, Miss Meanie, they're having a big cactus sale down at Prickly Pete's Garden Shop. Got all the cacti I need. Oh, look, a fashion show. You should go with some of your girlfriends. I don't have any girlfriends, Woodpecker. <laughs> No wonder she doesn't go out much. Hmm. But if Meanie had a gal pal to go downtown with, then maybe she'd get out of here for a while. You must be that adorable Miss Meanie my sweet nephew Woody has told me so much about. Who are you? Why, I'm Woody's favorite Aunt Pecky from Louisiana. I love what you've done with this place. It's so early neglect. Say, I was just about to go out for a fun makeover day. Why don't you come along with me? Just us girls. Oh, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of a homebody. Be, besides, I've got lots to do here. Blow out some earwax. Uh, put out some toe jam. Uh, count my change. Change, exactly. And you know what they say, dear. Change begins with you. <laughs> Yo? Yeah. Did I say yow? Oh, shucks, I meant you. Uh, change begins with you, dear. And if you're a homebody, then so am I. Why are you closing the shades? Because, dear, it's time for Aunt Pecky's miracle makeover treatment. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have nosy neighbors knowing all our secrets now, can we? <laughs> I like secrets. First, we're gonna unpack those bags. Oh. And we'll do it with Aunt Pecky's all-natural eye burner. It's a patented formula, you know. Doesn't that just make you feel ever so royal? Yeah. I feel kind of like Caesar. Caesar salad! <laughs> or a fruit cup. <clears throat> Don't you move a muscle. I'll be back in two shakes of a woodpecker's tail. <laughs> Pool goes in the back, boys. Beneath the tree. And try to keep it down. Neighbors, you know. What? Look what you did. You wrecked the pool and the lawn. We'll fix it, ma'am. You have Bonehead's promise. Well, you just better, Buster. Be Pecky! Am I done yet, Pecky? Oh, my, yes. But now, Pecky's perky permanent wave, here you come. <laughs> Having a makeover partner is so much more fun than I ever thought. <laughs> Something smells like garbage. Garbage? Oh, that's because you've been down in the dump so long, hon. Dumps? Ha! I get it. I smell like garbage because I've been down in the dumps. Ha-ha! <laughs> that, that's a good one, Pecky. Oh, just look. You can hold down a roof with those nails, child. Oh! <laughs> Tinkles! Tinkles! Tink. Well, it's about ding-dong time. Now hurry up and get everything installed. I haven't got all day. Missed you! Now hold your breath. Mud pack. <laughs> It'll take years off your face. Ooh, hair's done. The <laughs> hoodie. I feel like a new woman! Da -da. And a new woman demands a new outfit! Now you tidy up and get out of those old things! <laughs> you <-hoo. laughs> Out with the old you and in with the new you! Oh! Why? I, 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 
don't know what to say. I I love the new me. You keep the love fest going, Meanie. It's been so much fun keeping you busy, busy, busy all afternoon. Oh, oh my, how time flies. Kind of like me. I gotta go now. Toodles. But we'll do this again real soon, you bet. Bye bye Thanks, fellas. Later. I did it. Swimming pool, here I come. Hey, where's my pool? What? Hey, what's the big idea? Oh, hello, Woodpecker. Today was my lucky day. I got a makeover from your lovely aunt, and this notice says I won this pool. But you can't swim in it. They put it under the wrong tree. But do tell my new best friend, Aunt Pecky, she's invited any time. Oh, I will. Pecky! <laughs> Isn't this fun? <laughs> <laughs> you said it, sister. Oh, <laughs> that's right, Pecky. <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> A sport nuts paradise. The crowd goes wild. Woody, Woody, Woody. Huh? Hey, what's the big idea? My dear chap, I was merely admiring your uh, sporting prowess. Yeah? Well, admire it with your hands to yourself, bub. I have a proposition. If you would be so kind as to help my young uh, ward acquire some degree of sporting skill, I would gladly purchase everything you see in this store as payment for your coaching services. Everything in the store for free? Bring on the kid! Hello! <laughs> I come to play with you! Hunter? So good to see you again. Yeah, Woody, I learned sport. I wear shorts, I won't play with fox, cause I get the ball. Yeah. Oh, Woody, where are you? I better get a lot of gear, bub. Oh. Oh. Looky here, practice makes perfect. Put everything in the net. Okay, Woody. Everything in the net. <laughs> that ought to keep old Gunter busy till playoff season. <sighs> Time to catch a few Z's and dream of all my free sporting equipment. <sighs> 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 Now watch the ball and hit it back when it comes to you. I, I, Woody! <laughs> it's just you against the tennis ball. What are we going to 
rendezvous des ha 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 ha! Anything that puts as much distance between you and me as possible. Okay, good old kid, old kid. You'll be a natural at track and field. Uh huh, uh huh. Bouncy, bouncy, baby! Who's the smiling lady? <laughs> All right. Let's see you make that. Aye, aye, coach. Buddy. Oops. Tubo, Tubo, man, can make it there. Free sports equipment is worth this. <laughs> what do we play next, Coach Moody? Nothing, Gunter. I quit as coach. Do you hear me? I quit. You can't play hockey. You can't play tennis. You're not cut out for track and field. All you're good for is destroying things. He has the ball. Get him! What an astounding job, Woody. You've made Gunter a champion in just one day. Hmm. Hmm. Wonder which sport would be less strenuous. An easy game of croquet or a lazy game of badminton? Coach Woody! Come out, come out, wherever you are! Is this the super coach who will teach me to play as good as you, Gunter? Ah, uh, Gunter, you don't need me. You're good enough to be a coach now. Oh, happy, 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 happy day! <laughs> oh, this is fun. Now what? Now we jump and jump and jump! <laughs> I'm a bunny! I'm a bunny! I'm a bunny! Ah, like the old saying goes, it doesn't matter if you win or lose, it's how you keep old Gunter busy playing the game. <laughs> <laughs> this is the home of Wally Walrus, owner and manager of a quiet and respectable rooming house. As we look in on this reputable old buddy duddy, we find him enjoying his weekly bath. While upstairs, a slap happy tenant is enjoying a game of, well, of all things, <laughs> indoor golf. should overlook this little incident. But I'm not going to! <laughs> now, one more peep out of you and... Here, read the rules. Oh, well, I 
didn't want to take a bath anyway. My dime! I lost my dime! <laughs> Sometimes, you know. Ah, uh, don't worry, Nuthead. Together we can beat any ghost we find at that old abandoned house. Abandoned oh, no. house? Sounds perfect for scaring those two right out of their little wooden heads. <laughs> oh, Billy, that would be the most joyous of fun. <laughs> but, but, but what if there are ghosts haunting that place within? There's no such things as ghosts. <laughs> What's the matter? Your collar on too tight? Three, two, one, and action! Tonight, on Splinter and Nuthead's Totally 
me true tales of terror and scary stuff you see in the dark, we will film the very first ghost capture ever. Right uh, behind this... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, this should be sincerely as easy as taking the third grade for the fourth time, Billy. <laughs> as they cannot even open the simplest of doors. Yeah, all we gotta do is jump out and say, Boo! These kids will run like a drippy nose. Uh... Hey, Splinter, we can't get in. Wait, Nahead. I got an idea. Wood woodpeckers. Get it? one of my green jelly snacks, which I have come to love so much, Billy. By the way, might I interest you in one of these particularly effervescent treats? No. Now knock it off and help me haunt! Oh, I haven't seen anything this scary since Uncle Woody's meatloaf surprise. Uh. <laughs> I'm repeating just thinking about it. <laughs> Helmet cam! As promised, we will film the capture of a ghost, starting now! <laughs> Those woodpeckers are not seeming to be of the scared variety, boss. Then we gotta make it scarier. Wasn't so bad. Told you we could handle this, Nothead. Deploy Spook Shoot! Quick, we gotta hide! What's that noise? Oh, those would be jelly snacks, Billy. Would you like one now? No, I would not! But that gives me a brainstorm. Come on! Now, without fear, we bravely take you back into the haunt site, ready for another round with that ghost. Louis, your sweet tooth came in handy after all. We could be next! Ghost Hunters, go! Deploy Echo Suction Dart! Yuck! You just ate ghost slime! It's not ghost slime. It's those jelly snacks Louie eats. Those bullies are trying to scare us. Then we should scare them right back. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna scare those guys right out of their underpants. Oh, oh, oh. You have used all of my jelly snacks, of which I no longer have any to eat. Therefore, I am wanting that I should not be part of this scaredom any longer. <laughs> Billy. Oh, b -b 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 Billy. There's a. What are you g -g 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 going about? <sighs> There's no ghost. <laughs> Uh-oh. We did it! Yay! Hooray! <laughs> I 
guess there are no real ghosts here after all, Splinter. Yeah, but I think there's a killer croc living in Ms. Meanie's toilet. We can film that. <laughs> I saw a bog monster in that big puddle outside Mr. Galagali's garden center. Uh-uh. Uh-huh, yeah, uh-uh, no way. Yeah. No way. Yes, it's true. <laughs>
Snuff, you're hired. Meanie, we've been getting swamped every night at dinner rush. I'm putting you in charge of training, uh... Winnie Woodpecker. Gotta run. I got a truck of lard waiting on the docks. Hi. Welcome to Gecko Pacheco's. Why, thank you. Let's get one thing straight, Missy. I've been the car hop here for 22 years. You're not just gonna sweep in here and take over my territory. Now, let's roll! <laughs> Newbies. Huh. Hmm, skinny skates. <laughs> They'll get you every time. Hey, woodpecker wheels, move it or lose it! <laughs> Can't make it too easy for her around here. She might like it and want to stay. <laughs> Nothing like a big tray to weigh you down, I always say. <laughs> this is a pronto delivery to car 27. Senior Ocho's a regular customer, so don't screw up. <laughs> don't just stand there. You're a meal on wheels! <laughs> Guess I showed that gal a thing or... <laughs> Triple your order for free! Three times as much food for regular price! Triple your order at Gecko Pacheco's today only. This will get rid of that woodpecker once and for all. Come on, where's my order? I've been waiting longer than Excuse me, I was here first. first. It's triple your order hour, meaning triple the work for you, woodpecker. Um, isn't someone else who works here going to help with this rush? Um, no. <laughs> That's a good one. No. <laughs> She's a fruitcake on skates. Hey. I can handle my job and hers. Car number seven, car number eight, car number nine, car number ten. So then I said to her, no. Get it? No. <laughs> I'm done. I'll take my break now. <laughs> Does it? There's only one way to get rid of Miss Wheelie Two Shoes. Detour, keep it moving. Find an empty stall anywhere. Have fun. Oh, Winnie! The dinner rush is here, and they all seem to be on your side. Come on, I was here first. Oh, when is someone gonna take oh. my order? 15, 76, 42. They were spread all over. Calm down! Don't get your shorts in a bunch. Everyone will be served in the order they arrive. Somehow. Meanie, you've got a tag team with me. These orders are all over the parking lot. Oh, if you can't handle it, quit! This is how you want to play it? Fine by me. What's that crazy woodpecker doing now? Ha! What did that accomplish? Watch and learn. 15, 46, 42, 38, 9, 12. 82. <laughs> no, it can't be. No one's ever done those kinds of maneuvers before. She'll win over all my best customers. She'll be here forever. <laughs> Unless. 
Look at me skate! Oh, <laughs> I'm a little car hot, short and sweet! Stop! Meanie, your behavior! I have no choice but to fire you! No, no, please, boss! Please let me stay! Please! I'll do and hate the hang! Um, sir? Why, even though nothing will ever replace my statue, if she'll agree, it's a great idea, Winnie. Daddy, make it talk! Howdy, partner. Welcome to Gecko Pacheco's Tex-Mex restaurant. Man, that's lame. It's three for Thursday. Three meals for the price of one. All right. Keep up the good work, Meanie. Ha! <laughs> I gotta get another job. <laughs> 